look at how cute. This is in the festival show place. So cute. I got this couple of things beer. to try. Come get some.
Look how big this one is back here that's coming. See it? Living Laboratories, where scientists from Epcot and the U.S. Department of Agriculture are exploring innovative ways to produce bountiful harvests now and into the future. It's our home to the greatest diversity of plants on the planet. Many of these, like papaya, bananas, cacao, coffee, and rice, are well known around. Many are rich in vitamins and minerals, while others are well adapted to growing in less than ideal conditions. Some, like the water lily, thrive in wet, swampy areas and waterways. All parts of this plant, even the flower petals, are edible. More than 28 million tons of bananas are eaten annually, making it the most popular fruit in the world. Tilapia, bass, and catfish, like the ones you see here, are three of the more popular crops raised by fish farmers. The sustainable system we're using here recycles the water in the tanks. These plants are definitely on their way up. Innovative growing techniques like these increase yields while more efficiently using resources. Here is our integrated pest management program. By populating our greenhouses with beneficial insects that prey on harmful pests like aphids and flies, we are significantly reducing our reliance on conventional pesticides. Some of our best ideas have been inspired by nature, like these fruit and vegetable trees. By growing these ground plants vertically, we can increase yields. In our lab, Epcot scientists are working with the U.S. Department of Agriculture on a number of innovative projects. The goal of these efforts is to produce higher yielding and better quality plants. Tortillas. 
stole my tortillas. Say what? She stole my tortillas. Uh -huh. <laughs> what are those? Are those plantains? Those, those are plantains. Mexican bananas.